What's up you guys, it's Elise Gornex here and today I present to you the fifth episode of my Adobe Premiere Pro tutorials. Now today we're going to be doing covering um, effects, simple effects and also some complicated effects. Now this is practically where I'm not the one who's going to be to basically doing the tutorials. This The effects go out to however you guys want your videos. So I'm going to just be covering some basics, um, blurs, sharpens, I think I'm doing perhaps a little bit of stylized as well, I don't know, we might get onto that. But um, I'm basically going to be covering the basics, but this is really down to you guys. What do you guys want to do to your video? You just have a look for your effects, put it in, and then muck about with the settings. It's really down to you. So this is where I kind of step back and say this is how you do it. And then you guys go off and do whatever you want. So, you know, that's just, just going to let you know that. So, last lesson, we learnt our keyframes. So, this is going to help us with some of the, you know, timings of the, the, um, of the effect coming in and out. So, if you guys uh, don't know how to use keyframes yet, if you probably click top left, I would have put an annotation up uh, talking about my previous episode. So let's go ahead and get into our effects. So we have played around with the um, video. So I'm just good. last uh, last episode. So I'm just gonna drag it back in here. Okay. So scale that just frame. Okay. So what we're gonna do is we are gonna have our background video blurred for a second, and then our title is gonna come up, and then it's gonna unblur. So to do this. We simply have our video here. We go to video effects. We're going to go to blur and sharpen. And we are going to use camera blur. So basically, you're going to take and hold it with your hand and then drag it all onto the video one or whatever frame it is. And as you can see here, our video has literally gone mad. So to change the blur, it would have come up in this little bar here at the top which says video effects and then it will be at the bottom here. So you drop it down, it says camera blur and what you do for a keyframe, you need to have this little timer ticked. But if you don't want a keyframe, you just leave it off. So we're just going to try and get a reasonable amount, so obviously 0% is normal then you can go up to 100% which looks like it's just completely mad. So we're going to start at 0%, make a keyframe, we're going to zoom in here to get and there's some nice keyframe plotting here. We're going to move up a little bit and then we're going to drag the blur right up and we're going to go even more and then this is where our hello comes in. It's so going to move across here. So as the hello goes out, we want our blur to go down. and then we want our video to hit zero. Okay, so once we've set our, our keyframes, we're just gonna play and see what it looks like here. So our video goes blurred, hello. Obviously, this goes on for a little bit here. And then back out. So that's a simple blur and sharpen. Um, Basically you can use that if you're having text in front and you don't want the video behind to be seen as well or whatever you want like that. It's, like I said guys at the beginning this video effects is all down to you what you really want. So we are going to get rid of that and we're going to put it back in. And now we're going to play around with some stylized effects in. Now this is usually for um, if your video if you don't like how it looks you can just go ahead and uh, use some of the effects here. So with this alpha glow, as you can see it's added a nice little border around so we drop that down. So now we've got a glow. So as you can see this is providing a glow to the sides of our video. So this is if you, you know you want some um, I don't know text or info or perhaps some images or something down the side. So if you you know you can play around the colours, we've got a start colour of red and it ends with black, I don't know. But as you can see, look, this is adding a nice effect here, and then we can change the brightness however we want. A big glow. Um, 
like I said, this is all. Um, so this, is, this, is, this is using the end color here. If you take that off, as you, if I tick that, and then change that to white, as you can see here, unticking it, you see no white, and then ticking it, you know, it becomes some nice white to the side. So it's really about all playing around with the effects. But just remember, if you have the timer on here, it will set a keyframe, and if you take it off, it will ask you to delete all existing keyframes. You just want to hit OK and then you can just you know change it to whatever you want so if you take away the glow it's going to be constant but if you have a keyframe it's um, going to change so you just want to bear that in mind when using effects and uh, it's really down to what you want to achieve with your effects on your video so guys this has been a nice little episode of uh, Adobe Premiere Pro tutorials this has been all about video effects Arm Elite Squad X and I will see you next episode